Have you been to a prayer service and have seen people jumping, shouting, dancing and maybe even screaming, shouting the words hallelujah aloud and you wondered what's going on here? Is this truly right or permitted to do in a place where God is supposed to be making himself known to people? Is it right to do such things? Well, when you open up your Bibles and read about King David, now remember, David was a shepherd boy, but was promoted by God to be king over the people of Israel. And see what he does when God lifts him up. It says in 2 Samuel chapter 6, verse 14, it says, And David danced before the Lord with all his might. That means he did not just dance. He did not just shake his hip or wave his hands, but it says there he did it with all his might. That means his entire being, he was praising God, dancing for God. And then it goes on saying, so David and all the house of Israel brought the ark of the Lord with shouting. So he's dancing with all his might. Now it says he's shouting and with the sound of the horn, there is a loud sound all around that place. Come on, it's noisy. And what they are doing it? They're doing it in the presence of God. You see, David was grateful to the Lord. Why? Because from a shepherd boy, God lifted him up. I'm sure we are all grateful unto the Lord, right? For the things that God has done in our lives. We were all in a mess. We were all heading in a downward trend. There was no hope for us. And God picked us up from that pit and placed us on higher ground. Come on, we all have reasons to be grateful unto the Lord. And how do we show it? We show it with our praise. We show it with our dance. We show it by shouting hallelujahs unto the Lord. Come on, let every being, let every cell in your body praise the name of God for the wonderful things he has done. But David was not only praising God because he was grateful. He was also praising God because God deserved the praise. Because God is the great I am. David knew that everything, everything is all about God. When we read in, uh, in the same chapter, in 2 Samuel chapter 6, and we read verse 21, the latter half, David declares, I will make merry before the Lord. In verse 22, he says, I will make myself yet more contemptible than this and I will be abased in your eyes. That means I don't care for my name, for my pride, for my position. I will let it out. Why? Because I know my God is great. You see, we need to be people who praise God. We don't need to look around when you go for a prayer service. You don't look at what people do. You look to God and lift up the name of God. Exalt Him. If you dance, you dance unto the Lord. If you shout, you shout unto the Lord. Let every cell in your body lift up God. When you read in Psalms 150, we see the psalmist there declaring from verse 3, praise Him with trumpet sound, praise Him with lute and harp, praise Him with tambourine and dance, praise Him with strings and pipe, praise Him with sounding cymbals, praise Him with loud clashing cymbals. Verse 6, let everything that has breath praise God. Come on. That means whatever you have, use it to praise God. Every cell, every instrument, lift up God because he is worthy. One is because I'm grateful to the Lord. All that I am is because of all that God has done for me. And two is because God is the great I am. He deserves it. We need to declare to the world that he is the great I am. A big, big God. So next time you enter a prayer service, stop looking around, start looking up and praise Jesus. God bless you.